Imagine looking forward to a week of vacation with your extended family. Well, you certainly wouldn't expect them all to show up at the right place and the right time if you didn't provide them with a destination and a clear plan of how to get there. It's surprising then how many organizations lack a clear strategic action plan. As one French writer put it, a goal without a plan is just a wish. So why do so many organizations with smart leaders fail to do effective strategic planning? Well, there are many reasons, but the two that we hear most often are these. One, they're just too busy. Or two, they just don't know how to go about it. In fact, one study showed that only 8% of leaders are good at both strategy and execution. In our experience, helping businesses, nonprofits, and churches develop strategic plans, we have found there are four key elements to an effective strategic plan. First, it's important to solicit broad input. You want to know how a broad spectrum of your stakeholders feel about the organization, what its strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats are. Second, it's important to gain leadership team alignment. It's critical that your key leaders believe these are the right goals and the right way to get there. Third, develop an actionable plan on a page. It's important that you have the right metrics, milestones, and owners in place so that you can hold your team accountable to accomplishing the plan. Also, try to get it on one page. It doesn't help to have a thick, glossy binder of a strategic plan that just sits on the shelf and collects dust. And finally, be sure to use a good facilitator. Some teams have someone that can help them with this, but many find it helpful to hire an outside facilitator who can help them with the process, who can challenge their assumptions, identify gaps, and so forth. In fact, just this week, we got a call from an organization that was doing a strategic plan. Even though they had a consultant on their board of directors, they wanted some outside help to help them with the process. So as you think about your organization, remember, Rowing harder doesn't help if the boat is headed in the wrong direction. So the question is, how do you keep your boat headed in the right direction? Comment below. Thanks for watching.